Button up tight, friend. You're about to experience some of the roughest, wildest country on the North American continent. The Northwestern wilderness is a cold and unforgiving hunting ground. Out here, food and shelter are in short supply, and large predators pose a constant threat. The game animals in these parts are warier and tougher than their southern cousins. The snow and mist can mask your movements and help you cut a trail, but the shifting winds and icy ground cover can just as easily reveal your position to every critter in the county. Keep in mind, we're not the only hunters in this area. The grizzly loves a juicy elk steak as much as anybody, and I expect the big brown bears will be on the prowl today. Hello, hello, hello. I'm the Painter Dog and welcome back to the northwest region of Cabela's Big and Hunter Pro Hunts. I hope you're having a lovely day. My day is actually quite good, thanks. So let's have a look at what we have here. That one is a bow hunt. Three eight bolt pump action. And the base three three eight. So let's see. We have that. But let's buy the polymer tips so that we have him. And now, soft points. Let's have a go. That's a bear hunt of a bow hunt. And two eight point elk of a rifle from a stand or a blind. And we need an elk call. Okay, so let's take this one the bugle in the stand. And still have a quick check. Those are elk. There's something over there as well on that side. Let's see as soon as we get. But the problem is now this stand is. Oh, yeah, wait, but this, this one can swivel. Which is great. There's one dude. Let's go. As he turns him, you can try and take our shot. <sighs> Come on. I didn't want to go too far to the side because I didn't want to get uh, too far back. Long shot, nice and clean. Because I didn't want a stomach shot. Put the soft points in. And let's follow up. Now, I don't expect you'll get another good shot here today. The local game needs some time to settle down. Okay, okay. I didn't expect to get another great shot here today. Almost there. One trophy left to complete the hunt. So the wind is blowing in a southerly direction. Let's move up. So we are going to be at the bedding areas. And then they might move to the feeding areas. So 
So you know what? Let's move over here first. Then we can go around and uh, work from the south all the way to the north and see if we can spot that guy. I think that will be the way to go. As you just saw, we did find a guy. But now the problem is we aren't in a stand or a blind. So that might get problematic. Now I'm going to try and walk around because I won't be able to get to that one. Because of the wind, we'll, won't be in our favor and it's really close to them. Now I need to try and get around them without spooking them. There's another dude coming up. Which is great because we have choices now, but it's a bit bad because now we have more animals that can spook. I'm going to crouch walk all the way. As soon as I start getting suspicious, then we can lie down and crawl and all that. But for now, I think this will be fine. Just keep an eye out. Just need to get to that stand, that's all. When I have a polymers, I'm going to use them. The only reason I don't really use the 338 as much is because you have you get little amount of ammunition at a time. And usually I just take a rifle that I have equipped and then I go for open hands. Although in this playthrough I didn't really do that yet. Just lie still, and then we move again. We are really in cover now. Not the best cover, but he won't be able to see us here. As soon as we are behind these rocks, rocks, then we can crouch again and move. We are so close to that sand. I don't really want. To. Stay alert for shift and winds. Keep downwind your yeah. target. Obviously the wind now changes, eh? That's just our luck. And now we lie down and we wait a bit. See now the wind is not in our favor. It's a bit more suspicious every time we crawl. Let's stay quiet for a bit and see if this works. I'm so close to that stand now. Now this stand on this side might have been better. Still not great but it might have been better. really slow moving. Now I have to wait for him to turn gr entirely green and then we can walk or crawl a bit further. Just need to get to the stand without spooking the herd.
This is a dude that we marked, and then there's that guy as well. I don't think it's going to... I don't think he's going to turn green now anytime soon because of a wind. Because they know I'm here. Really aware of it the entire time. I need to stand still. It's orange. Yellow, I'm fine with moving around. Orange, I'm a bit skeptical. I don't really want to risk it. We've been stalking this guy now for more than five minutes. I don't really want to lose him. And lie still. Wait for it to go down to really yellow him to look away and then we crawl yeah I'm so close if I could crouch walk it would be less than two seconds when I'm at the at the stand No use in me calling them because they are close enough. I will only spook them now. Come on, give me the pop up that we can get into the, the hide or the stand. This is really slow, slow going. If the wind didn't change... The Watch the wind. You don't want to get caught flat-footed if you're suddenly upwind of the animals. Okay, the wind is a bit better now. Okay, there we go. Bad guys are 7 and a 7. Looks like they are moving away now. Let's use the call. He's green now. We'll probably be able to call him a bit closer. With the rest of the herd walking off. I really like the accuracy of this rifle in game. Come on, turn, and then we can take a shot. Really nice trophies that we are going to get from the previous one and this one as well. They walk really far when you call them. <laughs> And a ricochet. Double lung shot. Excellent shot placement. Won't go far. And I don't expect you'll get another good shot here today. The local game needs some time to settle down. And let's play my trophy. I would say this was a successful start to this region, and I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you in the next one. Cheerio!